is our room, guys, 201. Put the door key in there. Hello. Laura's chilling on the bed. On the bed, with the aircon. Is it comfy? Yes. We'll get to the bed in a minute. But just behind the door is a huge mirror. One for the ladies. Our bags are just there. Ignore them, we haven't unpacked yet. We're gonna head into the bathroom first. Beautiful sink, big mirror with a bit of lighting. Got some plug sockets next to the sink. Underneath you've got your towels and a hairdryer. Toilet, they provide two-in-one shampoo and conditioner and shower gel. And then the shower is huge. It's got a rainfall shower head. Is that what it is? Rainfall? Or yeah, waterfall. Either or. Either way it falls. Potato, potato. You've got your towel rail right here. And then we have our robes. For the lapisine. And our, <laughs> and our slippers for the what? Lapisine. What does that mean? We do have a swimming pool here at the hotel. It's called a wellness centre. It's yeah, like a spa, right? Mm. But it also has a pool, has, I think there's a jacuzzi. There's a jacuzzi you yeah. can get a massage. There's quite a lot at this hotel. And then over here, we have our wardrobes. You have your coffee machine and coffee essentials. Slide this out, a little table to make your coffee on. It's pretty neat. You've got a mini bar menu. Soft drinks, three euros beer four euros and snacks range from two and a half euros to four euros not too bad quite well priced could be better could be worse and here's the fridge with basically all that was on the mini bar menu it's quite cool that they provide you with all that but it's also very tempting yeah we're gonna hopefully buy our own stuff right here is the wardrobe for your clothes Huge area, plenty of coat hangers, and some space up there. And in this one, our bed sheets, and your safe. Beautiful. Moving on, next to the bed. Looks like Laura's already claimed this side of the bed. <laughs> this is a cute little bedside table. Nice little drawer. Got your time, a Shuma radio, and an alarm. A little lamp for reading at night. An even bigger lamp. I quite like, I like the, the decor. decor and the um, the photos that are up there. Huh? Like, it's like boys club. You know, I can imagine like yeah. alcohol, all that. I don't know. Uh -huh. I don't know. It's very well decorated. I do like it. It's nice. Pillows are cool. They're nice. And then this side is the same minus the alarm. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, just a drawer. There's no plug sockets though that I can see. Oh yeah, there's one under there. <laughs> That's good. Two lamps, either side of the bed. Moving on round, you've got a nice little, uh, maybe Instagrammable corner. But also you can use it to use the mirror if I want to do my makeup in the mirror. See, this is why it's good having a girl here for these tours. <laughs> <laughs> so yes, you can do that. I was just thinking, sit in the corner, pose, <laughs> Chill. have a few pictures. And then the TV's up on the wall. We haven't yet switched the TV on, but I'm sure we will at some point. Got some more drawers here. There's a book, Paris Select. Anything in this one? Nope. So this would be pretty cool if you've got a laptop like I have. Do some work. Do some work while the girls are getting ready. Phone, that is an old school phone. Proper old school. I quite like that. And to finish off the room tour is the view. There's not much of a view, but it's got a proper French courtyard vibe to it. Very quirky view compared to other hotels we've been in. Very quiet. Very quiet. And pretty cool. Hope you enjoyed the room tour, guys. Drop a like if you did like this room. Leave a comment if you've got any questions. But we're now going to head out and enjoy Paris. Au revoir.